East and West is a series of artworks by Justin Lee comprising sculptures, prints, and paintings. Part of the series includes a small army of ancient Chinese warriors, modeled in reference to the terracotta army found in the mausoleum of the first emperor of China. However, these are accompanied by some anachronistic modern accessories objects from our time that appear out of place next to the ancient armor they wear. The Sam Touch Collection adaptations of East and West are smaller scale sculptures, about a third the height of the original, with a few finer artwork details. Similarly to the original, these adaptations are also made of fiberglass. They are mostly off-white, but with oversized black headphones worn over their headpieces and bright red neck scarves atop their armor. They stand at stiff attention, with their brows just as furrowed and their smiles just as tight. The armor is of the same design, with the same prize medals to the left of their chest plates, and the face of the mythological Ya Zi protruding from their belly guards. However, while the original sculptures had headphones in plain black, the outside of the adaptation's headphones are decorated with the Chinese characters Shuang Xi, ridged and painted in white. This is a symbol meaning double happiness, often associated with marriage. These warriors are also supported by a round pedestal, absent in the original. The Shuangxi symbol reappears in raised relief on these pedestals, accompanied on either side by two Pac-Men, similarly embossed. These Pac-Men are from an old classic video game, where you move Pac-Men around a maze, avoiding enemies and eating dots for points. They face each other with Shuangxi in the center, as if the Shuangxi were a dot about to be devoured. This trio of two Pac-Men with one Shuangxi is repeated around the sides of the pedestal. The artist Justin Lee is known for embedding subtle commentary on different social and cultural facets of Singapore in his art. This work is no exception, with the title offering a strong hint as to the subjects explored.